It's already 2020, but is it still worth it? Oh, the man. Most especially nowadays, almost all people have an access with the internet connection and the smartphone. There are uh, too many platforms you can use to do your podcasting. Now we have YouTube, Spotify, iTunes, and uh, many more. You can just Google it to see what are the other podcast platforms you can use. It is never too late to do what you want to do, most especially if you are passionate about it. And uh, just add a little bit of perseverance. So, sabi nga nila, kapag may uh, tiyaga, syempre, no? meron tayong nilaga. <laughs> Pero how would you start? How would you do it? Who is your podcast for? What is your podcast for? These are the questions you need to ask yourself before you start recording or uh, shooting your first podcast. Hi, I am Ni and you are listening to Project Yat Choi. And uh, this is our very first episode of our podcast. And uh, today we are going to talk about how to start a podcast. All right, so starting a podcast, of course, you will need some equipments. For an entry-level podcasting, all you need to have is a uh, recording device, a smartphone, yep. So, sabi ko nga kanina, almost all people ngayon uh, already have an access to a smartphone. And all of these smartphones have a recording applications. And uh, kung wala naman to, you can easily uh, search it on your uh, Play Store and App Store. Yeah. Pwede na rin minsan uh, doon mo i-edit yung uh, recording mo and after uh, editing it um, you can easily post your podcast into your um, chosen platforms. Huh? You don't actually need to invest for a microphone yet since um, you are just starting your podcast. Hindi kasi lahat tayo kayang uh, bumili ng microphones most especially the uh, dynamic and uh, condenser mics. Lalo na lalo na yung audio interface, di ba? <laughs> Medyo may kamahala ng mga yan. So, sa mga nakikita akong uh, nagsisimula pa lang sa podcasting, they are using their iPhones to record their uh, podcast and uh, ang mic na ginagamit nila eh, yung kasama nitong earphone. Minsan kapag napakinggan mo yung uh, mga recording nila, maganda rin naman yung quality. You know? Ang um, pinagkaiba lang ng uh, semi-studio setup is uh, the background noise. But uh, naman natin may iwasan yun. And we can always clean that up um, using some uh, editing device that we have. And you already have a recording device. You can um, already post your uh, first podcast. But if you want to uh, boost the quality of your recording, you can use a computer. So there are a lot of editing softwares out there. Uh, for example, um, nandiyan si um, Adobe Audition. Nandiyan si uh, Audacity. Uh, si Pro Tools. Yan, madami, no? So yung recording natin from the mobile phone, edit lang natin, tanggalin natin yung noise ng background, lagyan natin ng onting equalizer and uh, compression. Minsan, inonormalize pa natin, ano? Yan yung mga uh, some technical terms na ginagawa natin or ginagamit natin in terms of uh, recording. So, after mo i-edit, boosted na yung uh, recording mo, pwede na natin i-post yan in Spotify. Tapos, after posting your uh, first podcast, you can uh, easily share it all throughout your um, uh, social networking platforms. So, going back, if you are just starting your own podcast, sabi ko nga, you don't need to invest to a uh, good equipment yet. Mag-focus ka sa content ng podcast mo. That is the most important part of your podcasting. Kaya ka nga nagpa-podcast eh. Ano? And uh, by the way, uh, to all of our listeners that uh, doesn't know what podcasting is, so um, it's like broadcasting as well, but uh, we're gonna have to use internet to make a digital recording and um, have it available for uh, 
and downloading to a computer or mobile devices. Podcasting is used for um, streaming as well. So uh, we have uh, multiple streaming platforms out there for our podcast. So going back on uh, making your content, uh, kailangan makasaysayan siya or uh, may saysay siya. No? Uh, it can be an educational podcast. Yeah, it can be an audio drama as well. Katulad ng mga naririnig mo sa mga lolo't lola mo na pilaging nakikinggan sa radyo. Current events ba yan? Musical ba yan? Talk show? Reviews? Memes? Comedy? Madami, no? Napakadaming genres that um, you can do in your podcast when uh, you are recording. Alright, and uh, if you're going to start a podcast and uh, thinking what will be the content of it, I would highly suggest na dun ka sa porte mo kung saan ka may alam and uh, kung saan ka uh, mas maraming masasabi. You know? Mahirap kasi yung uh, magpa-podcast ka. For example, you're gonna be doing a uh, teledrama. E, hindi ka naman marunong umarte. Hindi mo naman magiging karakter yung boses mo. E, walang makikinig sa'yo. Ano? Pamurahin ka pa ng listeners mo. Or uh, kunwari, talk show ka. No? Usapan chismis ng artista. Diba? Show business. Eh, wala ka kilalang artista. Hindi ka naman mahilig sa kanila. Hindi ka naman mahilig sa showbiz. So, uh, walang say-say. Diba? Walang kwenta. Kaya, if you're going to think of uh, what will be your content or topic, dapat dun sa may, uh, may alam ka. Para hindi mahirap magsalita o hindi sa'yo mahirap uh, magkwento tungkol dito. Kung mahilig ka sa basketball, edi yun yung gawin mo. Review a lot of uh, basketball gameplays and uh, playoffs. So, and uh, talk about your uh, favorite basketball players. Yung mga stats nila, no? Ako kasi hindi ka mahilig dyan. And uh, kung mahilig ka sa gadgets, pwede din do a uh, review. You know, review a lot of uh, gadgets, as phones, uh, cameras, and uh, whatnot. And um, kung mahilig ka sa babae, o oh, kung mahilig ka naman sa lalaki, eh, pwede naman. No, pwede din. And uh, kung mahilig ka sa ano, yung, uh, yung ano, yung alam mo na. Yeah. Oh, pwede, yeah. pwede. Baka pati ako makinig din sa'yo. <laughs> So, sa pag-iisip ng uh, content or topic, you should think of your uh, target audience as well. Para mas maging effective yung podcast mo. Dapat lahat ng listeners mo eh, uh, relate dun sa topic para maatain mo yung audience retentions na sinasabi nila. Hindi yung, uh, uy, may podcast si ano, pakinggan ko to. Ay, alam niya, wala naman akong alam dyan eh. Huwag na akong pakinggan niya. May mga ganun, may mga ganun factor. So, uh, mag-record ka ng podcast mo... Uh, for example, all about um, rock music. Eh, Doon kami alam eh, syempre. Kailangan mo i-share yan. Kailangan mo i-market yung podcast mo. Magpo-post ka sa kung ano-ano mga social media platforms mo. Uh, most especially sa mga Facebook groups. no? Hindi ka pwedeng basta-basta na you're doing a podcast uh, regarding to rock music and uh, ipopost mo siya sa may buy and sell group. <laughs> Ewan ko lang kung hindi ka nila i-kick doon sa group. Ano? <laughs> And syempre, kailangan din. Yung content ng podcast mo is highly engaging. So, uh, for example, if you are a self-help or a motivational podcast, hindi pwedeng sabihin mo na, Oo, papayat ka, sige, kaya mo yan, papayat ka, laban lang. How, how your listeners would stay in your podcast? Puro ganun ka lang. But dapat bukod sa pag-encourage na papayat sila, uh, you should provide as well an option, uh, for example, for a uh, healthy diet. Ano ba mga ginagawa mo na kung dati ka nga mataba, paano ka pumayat? Di ba? Paano gumanda yung katawan mo para makatulong ka din sa listeners mo? And uh, by doing that, uh, you'll keep them uh, motivated and um, active all throughout your uh, podcast. Kailangan na uh, mamagnetize mo sila sa content mo. Right? So, ayun, you already have an equipment, you already have a content, and uh, you already know your audience. And uh, the next step for us is, uh, ano ang papangalan mo sa podcast mo? Ayan? 
So I chose this name because um, it has a history between me and uh, my uh, very special partner yeah, with the name Yats Choi being derived from Yats as Payat and Choi as Ba Choi. Uh, alam naman na siguro yung ibig sabihin yan, and no need to elaborate what's the meaning of it. So, uh, dapat catchy. No? Hindi ganun kahaba, hindi mahirap sabihin. Uh, hindi madaling kalimutan. Ayan. So, may recording ka na. May pangalan na yung podcast mo. Then, uh, it's time for you to create an account um, with your uh, chosen platforms. For example, Spotify, just create your account in there. Set up your um, r- podcast recording and start uploading. By then, you can uh, start sharing a podcast and build your uh, community for it. So, uh, what made me into podcasting? Bata pa lang ako, I, I, I always wanted to be a radio broadcaster. Uh, not because madami nagsasabi na, Uy, yung uh, boses mo, tunog radyo, ganyan. Hindi. Siguro ang dami ko lang gustong sabihin. ang dami kong pwedeng sabihin and uh, gusto ko maraming nakikinig sa akin kasi medyo uh, papansin kasi <laughs> ayun, gusto ko lang talagang uh, magsalita gusto ko mag-share and uh, most especially gusto ko na may matuto din sa kung ano yung natutunan ko no? and by doing this uh, podcasting uh, marami ka rin matututunan Especially if you're going to do one of your episodes, you need to uh, put some research regarding to your uh, topic. By this, matututo ka and matututo din yung listeners mo. Ayan, unlike before, I don't know um, anything about podcasting and now I know it. That's why I'm doing it. Kasi ako yung tipo ng tao na I always wanted to invest through uh, learnings, no? Ang dami kong gustong uh, matutunan. Ang dami kong uh, gustong gawin. No. Niipon ko lahat yan. And nang sa ganun, hindi ka limited sa isang bagay lang na ginagawa. Para kahit saan ka mapunta. No. Uh, madidiskartehan mo kung ano yung mga dapat mong idiskarte. O kung ano man yung pangangailangan mo, eh, kung saan ka mapunta. Magagampanan mo ito. You know. Apaga ng option. And um, before I forgot, no, if you were going to start a podcast and you still have your day job, don't quit. Alright? Huwag ka magre-resign. Hindi po kita kakapag-record ka na ng podcast mo, eh, wala na, magre-resign na ako. Magpo-focus na lang ako dito sa may pagpa-podcast ko. No, 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 no. Don't, don't ever do that. Paano mo popondohan yung equipment mo? wala ka namang pagkukuhaan. Alang naman sa may pagpapodcast mo to kunin. Eh, you're just starting out. ba? Diba? Mahaba-haba pa lalakbayin natin. For me, this is my first recording. I'm uh, thinking about uh, a year or less than a year for it uh, to grow, to have a um, big community um, under my podcast channel. So, uh, I still have my day job. Pumapasok pa ako. And, uh, by the way, today is still uh, quarantine. is still the May of the 2020. So, uh, isa rin to siya factor no? <laughs> na kung bakit ako nakapag-start ng uh, podcast ko. So, yeah. If you have a day job, uh, don't quit. Just uh, think of this as uh, one of your hobby. No? Instead of doing your uh, vices, mag-podcast ka na lang. Kung may idea ka, sulat mo agad if um, you were a type of person na uh, nag script Kung may naiisip ka na magandang topic, uh, go ahead and uh, record it before it's too late. Kasi may mga tipo na tao na, Uy, maganda to. Ito, ito, podcast ko to, record ko to, no? Ay, ano na nga pala ulit yung sasabihin ko? Ano na ulit yung i-re-record ko? May mga ganun. <laughs> Nawawala ng uh, idea bigla. No? So, um, 
record lang ng record, post lang ng post, and uh, hindi mo mamamalayan na uh, lalaki na rin yung community natin. No? At uh, sana isa ako doon, kaya uh, sa inyong mga nakikinig, maraming maraming salamat sa inyong pagsuporta. Suportahan nyo ako, please do like share and uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's a Project Yats Choi. Once again, it's Project Yats Choi. No? Um, spread the word. Share with, share with your friends. I hope you are listening not only by yourself, but uh, with a friend as well. And I hope you enjoyed this um, episode of my podcast. You will be hearing from me a lot more soon. All right? I'll be posting uh, some of the uh, schedules of uh, my episodes. And uh, before I post my next episode, I'll be uh, releasing out a trailer for it. So, abangan. <laughs> Ayun, maraming maraming salamat ulit sa pagtutok. Maraming maraming salamat sa pakikinig. And, um, yep, hanggang dito na lang tayo. Once again, this is me. My name is Ni. And uh, thank you for listening, Project Yats Choi. And...